Ninja Scroll that I didn't even know about. Dude, I fucking love Ninja Scroll. So, the, okay, this was the trinity for me back in the day. You ready for this? It was Wrath of a Ninja, uh, Sword for Truth, and then Ninja Scroll. Now, all these were actually supposed to be tied together. But the way Wrath of a Ninja was played out, I didn't feel like it tied in completely. Sword for Truth, technically, was a complete tie-in to Ninja Scroll. But those three uh, together, if you watch those like back to back, oh god. But if you do it, make sure you watch Sword for Truth before you watch Ninja Scroll. Yeah, you said Sword for Truth. Yep. Oh, Wrath of a Ninja, Sword for Truth, then yep. Ninja Scroll. Yeah. Alright. I don't remember. It's a stuff back this way. Actually, next time you're not you know, and I hear me in the mic. I was gonna say next time you're down here on this side. Can y'all hear me in the mic? I can definitely show you Hello? Sword for Truth because I still have that DVD. Hello. What's up? Can y'all hear me in the mic? Can you hear me? Yeah, but I'm like making sure like I can hear yeah, me. You're good. Oh, by the way, welcome back to the game room, guys. We're picking up on our game last the gameplay of uh, mm -hmm. uh, Division Two here. We, we 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 had a rant last time where we were talking about uh, games changing and stuff, and now we're having an anime rant this time. Because so. <laughs> why not? <laughs> oh, you know what? I need to really sit down and watch now because it's starting to really pick pick up from what I'm here. I need to sit down and fucking watch Fire Force. I really do. Yeah, I, 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 since my good, incident I... happened, I haven't been watching any anime because I'm just, I don't know. I guess because I just can't get up to turn on Anime Network or, uh, I say Anime Network. Uh, there's a whole <laughs> anime shout network. out to anybody who knows what that is. Uh, anime Network, uh, but uh, I meant to say Crunchyroll and or Hulu because that's where all my anime listings currently are right now. Uh, But yeah, I just, I haven't been able to get up to do so because I'm barely in front of the computer anymore. Like, I'm mostly just, like, resting and trying not to fall over inches, so. Um, and apparently my wife decided to make an appearance just now, guys, so if you hear a familiar voice in the background, that's her. <laughs> oh, yeah. Dude! Oh, is that in SNK or Capcom? Who made who made bloody who made bloody roar? Bloody roar, if I remember correctly, was Capcom. Yeah, who did make that? Right? Oh, but <laughs> bitches didn't fucking announce anything on the Capcom shit. Oh my god, dude, I'm waiting for that game. Fucking bloody roar, man. So god, good. I used to. Oh man, oh, I used to, dude. I used to spend spend countless hours on that game. Holy the. The intro to Bloody Roar 3 was like the most anime intro you could ever have. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? I know. I love that song, though. That guitar riff in that song was amazing. Oh, uh, dude. It's so good. It's such a good game. I can't... Dude, I can't... Ah, oh, man. Dude, if Bloody Roar comes out, I will personally make sure that's Fight Night material. Like, like at least three times. What do you mean? Fight Night material? What do you mean? No, three times. Fucking no, no. You, fighting you every... You hadn't heard the full thing, man. I will make sure it is fight uh -huh. night material at least every two to three weeks. So that nah, means dude, that it's at fight least material. every it's, two weeks, for me, there will be bloody for me, it's, it, Nah, for me, for me, it would be like every day, dude. That's so how much YouTube I do. That was my child. Not allowed that was... that sort of shenanigans because... Oh, yeah, I know, I know, I know. Trust me. If I could do I that... Know what I'm, I, I know what I... But I'm already I know, but I'm just, I'm just like, like, you know... Videos in a week yeah... Before, so. Yeah, but it's but it's such, a, such a, such I don't know, dude. It's such a like like a nostalgic game, dude. It's my childhood, so like I would just go ham on it. I would go ham on it, a hundred percent. You know what? I'll I'll say this: if I can find, if I can find an emulator for it, and use Parset to put it up and everything for us to play online on a PC, would you be willing to?
Hello. Maze, where'd you go? Yep. Yeah. I'm here. Okay. Yeah, no, did you hear what I said? Yeah. Yeah, uh, what was that about? I, uh, my, I was paying attention uh, to food I was saying, if I could find a here. really good emulator for it, because I, 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 I gotta find a good uh, PS2. I, 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 wish, I wish they would just, like... Ah oh, man, I wish they, I wish they would just like let you like have it backwards compatible, dude. Because nice. PlayStation is such, a... but PlayStation's ass with that, dude. Hmm. Because honestly, I would if if I could just play it straight out, I would just pop my bloody world three in right now, and we call it day. <laughs> would you really? Uh, yes, I would. You really call it call it a day. Just like I still love Street Fighter Alpha three. Mm, now we're talking. Which is which is the one that most people don't like for some reason. I don't understand the hate for Alpha Three and the love for Alpha Two over each other. That's why I start. That's why I started off with Alpha Three. That's why I got the collection. Just to like try to <laughs> try to do it from like the start. I mean, I've played all of them, even with the collection. I've played all of them beforehand. I just I've always thought that each game did a good job of something. I don't understand the hate of one over the other. Uh, you see? The only thing yes. I could think that you could truly hate about Alpha Three is just the fact that Bison's busted. The most busted Psycho Crusher in, the, in all of Street Fighter history, but also one of the best boss teams in Street you know, Fighter history. I'm opening all of these, all of these caches, so you can get better stuff. And I keep seeing you just run past everything. Well, I didn't run up that way yet. I double back and got look, it. Look, look. Even from when the mission started, I was like, open something, and it'll probably be coming good. You'll be mixed into the fight. Well, it's good that you're immersed. Yeah. Plus, I don't really have a whole lot of storage space left, so I'm also trying not to <laughs> pick up a bunch of nonsense that I can't use. Or, you know, yeah, is, beyond, is below me. Which majority of these yeah, drops yeah, that I've been getting stuff. have been, so... Cool, cool. So that guy. Rhodes, that fire tower there. Anything we can do about it? There's got to be a power source on it somewhere. Destroying that usually does the trick. Another one. You and I, we're all the same. Destroy the panels on the top. No, I was looking for another one. Uh -huh. Assuming you watched all of Capcom yesterday, right? Mostly. I was disappointed they didn't... They didn't... Yeah, yeah, so... Jenkins said something earlier. I don't know if you caught it when he said it. He said something about that trash Capcom uh, pre presentation. What happened? Uh, it, 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 it was... It, it was it was pretty trash. They showed like some pretty trashy stuff. They didn't even remaster like some of the like they didn't even like they didn't even try to bring a new Marvel vs. Capcom game. No no remake of the third one or whatever the fuck. No nothing. It was it was ah it was kind of, it was ass honestly. That's that like that's what people are saying that Nintendo saved the E3. I mean, don't they always though? Oh my. Yeah. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Why is this happening? Get, you should have gotten cover and then revived. Your position. Yeah, like look. Right here. Right I, here. It right wouldn't right. let me from that spot. That's why. That's why I just was like, fuck it. Just fuck it. Uh, I'll cover you. You just gotta uh, turn the lever in the middle. One sec. <laughs> it, 
is it wrong that walking up and shooting people at point blank range with a shotgun is just therapeutic? <coughs> is that wrong? No. Uh oh. You gotta shoot uh, where she's at, up top, in the control room. Uh, making me wish I had my sniper build now. No, you just gotta shoot the glass. I'm not even using the sniper, I'm using the light machine gun. No, yeah, the thing will work. I'm using subs and a shoddy. You flushed her out, Agent. Now take her down. Because, you know, that's the right way to go. Subs all day, every day. Exactly what happens. What's up, you asked me, Jim? Mm -hmm. Oh, jeez. So, what exactly did they announce yesterday for Capital? I don't remember much. But they they just announced like a bunch of Capcom stuff, cause I I kept like from that from that one I watched I watched the Xbox Xbox one, and then now I watched the Nintendo one, so I barely remember shit from that shit. No, nobody cares. It, it was no, so bad. Cares I, it was. It, it, I don't need to hear about. Bro, it was so it was so it was so bad. Like it was so bad that I I literally rather watch the Xbox one again. That's and the Capcom. actually saying a lot. Honestly, it Capcom, is. Get your shit together. When the blank screen wins over you, that's a problem. <laughs> yeah. That mm -hmm. bitch is mm -hmm. Oh, man. Sticky mom, sticky moms. Everybody, nope, didn't have enough to loot it. Anyway. <laughs> well, yeah, if you, if you Granata! Stuff, you, stuff, then you could just deconstruct some stuff and then take it to your uh, retail station. Yeah, it's probably about what I'm going to do. With her gone, we should start seeing a decline in their operations. We're sending in a team to secure. Well, wait, I can't. Well, I had to go back to DC, but I can't go back to DC yet, can I? So we're bound to find something of interest. What do you got to do with DC for? Isn't that where the retail station is? Retail station is No, you have it. Yeah, it's in New York. It's in the settlement. I didn't see it. Did I overlook it? Oh, oh, yep. Because the way they have it set up is just mostly desks and like. Even the stash box, like people run by us. Damn, and Sony didn't do its press conference there yet, did it? Ah, uh, because they wanted to be out of it, because they're... They're doing... They're do bro, trust me, they're doing a bunch of side deals. Yeah, so Sony's I'm doing some stuff right now. Yeah. yeah, watch. When they come when they come with the stuff, they gotta hit you hard with it. One game I really just wanted them to remaster, just one game, was Dead, Dead Space 1. Oh, yeah, Dead Space 1. Or even 2. Honestly, they should just... They, honestly, they should just, re they should just remake some of the classics. PlayStation games. Yeah. Dude, you know you know how much I wanted to play Twisted Metal? Oh, I played Twisted Metal. Uh, uh, give, give, give me the original uh, Twisted Metals, like, one through three. Let's go. With the soundtracks oh that came God, with dude. those games. Do it. Yep. Make it happen. My boy's sweet, too. That is definitely something you, you I need in my life. Make it happen. Wait, did you fast travel? <laughs> no, I didn't. Did you? Yeah, I'm at the settlement now. There's actually a backpack trophy you can get from in here too. Um, where, oh yeah, Jack and Baxter. I know that. I, I want Baxter to be with. Oh god. Hell, hell yeah, bro. 
number two was the the most one I've played out of all of them. Ah, uh, they're yeah. all honestly, they're all fucking good. That's a fact. They're all good, even even the ra- even the racing one is good. Oh, yeah. I remember, I remember that one. Yeah, uh, ra- uh, racing, racing yeah. I believe Jack Jack and Daxter X racing or something. Yeah, Jack X. <laughs> Yeah, there you, you go. Played, um, you played the one for the PSP, Jack and Dexter. I played, I played all of them. I played the one for the PSP. I went from the PS2. I replayed it on the PS3 again. Not just Daxter, the other one, because people, people. No, the, all, it. all of them, all of them. I saw, oh, I, like it, it, even Daxter by itself as well. I play those. But you know what? This is why I love Insomniac because. Jack bro, and Dexter Inso- is bro, like Insomniac, Insomniac makes the best looking games right now. The That's best games right now, bro. I, I, I bro, I am yeah. telling you, Ratchet and Clank is such a good motherfucking mm-hmm. game. I, oh my god, I cannot wait for them to drop DLCs on that shit. That's why when I heard that they were making Spider-Man, like there's, the Spider-Man, there's, there's, they're like, oh, there's okay. like, like, there's good replayability. Oh my god, the game, the game is just so good. The Spider-Man from PS4, the one that they had just made from Marvel. Yep, and then, oh, and then, the, and oh, then, they, then uh. Oh, Insomniac, I, I, Insomniac I, I, is a good game. It's a good ass game. You played it good as fuck. A fucking Miles Morales masterpiece, nigga. That company is like good as fuck. Oh my god, I, bro, I cannot wait you guys to play that game on the PS5 with the 60, 60 frames and ray tracing. Oh my god, that game is just so good. Oh, dude, it's such a good game. I don't know why they didn't add no DLCs to that game, dude. You know, it's funny, they said in that game, it's going to be stuff pulling from multiple universes. Like Oh, yeah, it is. Not even just the Ratchet and Clank universe, I'm talking about different games in general. And I was mm-hmm. like, oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh, there's, um, there's you get a gun, you, you get, you get right. a port, you get a portal gun that, that actually get, uh, has mm-hmm. a bunch of references. Uh, there's, there, you can spawn, you can spawn fucking, you can spawn, uh, Bly Cooper, you can spawn fucking... The the band from tw- uh, Twisted Metal, the the you know the band with the fucking clown face on it. Mm-hmm. Uh, you can you can yeah 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 you can spawn you can you can spawn you can spawn some uh you can spawn some like NPCs from the other games. You can spawn uh Daxter. You can you can spawn Jack and Daxter. You can po- you can spawn Jack by by himself. Dude, there's a bunch of stuff you can you can spawn from this. Uh, there's so much reference you, in that game. You know why I love the new one they came out with because they brought back the hover boots. And oh yeah. The time was like the most. That oh dude, the, the, the hover boot, the hover boots are so good. That's why they're so good. They came out with the sequences, just like right. Assassin's Creed. Like they had places where you could like glide off of shit and make jumps, do like tricks and everything. And this one is like open world somewhat, but like everything is a part of the story. And I was like, golly. Insomnia just keeps getting better and better. Mm-hmm. Oh, the recall station is over here. Yeah, I saw it just now. Uh, and then you got the crafting station on like the opposite side. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Shit, actually, can you do the summit? Can't do the summit. You know what, Christian? I'm. I'm. Let me see if we can just get you through all the story missions. What did you? You got the check. Frames, did you ever beat the story mode with Joe or no? You know what the regular story? Detected. Yeah. Yeah, for this for New York. No, no. That's what I was saying. I have to complete this. He remember when he did it. We were separate because I was still finished. I had had that huge lapse from playing for a while because stuff was happening with Monster Hunter, and they put Fatalis and all that stuff in. Alright, uh, uh, I guess now you just gotta look for like any main missions you don't that aren't like uh, completely grayed out, not the side missions. Uh huh. Because I can't, I can't see anything but side missions. Missions for like uh, quarantine skyscraper. I can see uh, national bond bank. Matter of fact, this will do better. 
if you um back out of the map and press start and then go over to progression on the right side. Eight out of seventeen. And then once you click in the, yeah, once you click in that, it'll show you like uh, main missions, side missions, bounties, projects, and all that in the first window. So Warlords is at 47%. All right, so let me see something. You probably have to click on it, and then it should show you a list of completed, and then probably what to do next. Mm-hmm. Saying the quarantine skyscraper, the National Bond Bank, Police Plaza. Those are the things that are left at the moment. When the World of New York? Yeah. So you'd probably have to click on one of those because I'm not too sure. That's not showing me anything on my Click on it so that it's tracked and then you can hit there. So it is just a side mission, so what the hell? That's weird. For some reason, those not under side missions, though. Hold on. But you know what it is, too? When when did you actually start? Oh, no, no, I think it sets up. No, it's all right, it's all right. You can, you can uh, back up a bit because I think it sets up to the, the main missions. Supposed to. You just, end up, you just, aren't those yeah, all the Keeners, uh, Keeners, uh, Yeah, because you, you just started. That's why your watch, well, your level is at 35. Right. So once you get the watch, it goes up past 40. Okay, welcome to New York. Exactly. What part of New York are we in? Uh, financial district. Anywhere between the financial district and like the side streets. This is a lot of side alleyways you can sneak into where they got Shea Tech caches. You know, no, you know what it's, this is leading to me asking. Yeah. So, a, a, as a resident, how uh, how accurate is this area? <laughs> And kind of, they, they just try to condense everything. That's the problem. Not the, not really the problem, but it's just a lot better. Because if they had it, like, detailed, because you, you can pull from maps and see, like, similarities in between right. certain places, but not completely all the way, you know? Right. If you do it that way, people start getting fucking scared. They'll think this shit will happen. I mean... <laughs> Where shit is going. Yeah, exactly. Where shit is going. Like if you look up, you can see like the scaffold. If you look up, you can see the scaffold and fall down. There's a distress beacon somewhere. Because it was like you had a you know certain triggers for the game.
We need a stronger lead. Yay, brains, right? Hey, there's a nearby church what? community. They've been monitoring the patrols in the area. and may have some intel that could be valuable. No church in the wild. <laughs> no words. Words fail me. The hell's going on? Oh, back to the safe house to drop off the mission, Trinity Church, which is a real place. So you said back to the settlement. You said no, 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 no. Just, just, just follow me, dude. So we've got proof that Kajika's been here recently. Not the settlement, it's just the safe house. It's not too far. And plus, they're coming out with a different game that looks like Division, but isn't. Yeah. Um, I forgot what the name of it is. Because besides Division content, there's another, there's a free game that's coming out called Heartland. And it's supposed to be uh, strictly PvP, I guess like a, you know, one of them Battle Royale type of things. But they set the conditions in There's the type of game style that I'm not. I've just, well, I don't know, I've just never Royale. been into the Battle Royale slash, uh, I guess, what did you call, arenas? The ones with yeah, the but that's why I was yeah, scared. I've, just, I've never been into them. I try them. That's why I was not into them. That's why I was scared when Tom Clancy said they was making it, but they was going to keep it um, somewhat similar to, I think, Division 1. I was like, you had to uh, scavenge for resources and whatnot to keep yourself alive. I was like, mm, probably. Probably. I mean, it's free, so I'll still play it. It's free for me. The worst part about NYC is not, there's no DZ areas. I didn't even notice that. Uh, we're gonna stop recording here for now, but if you guys like the content or you want to see us play something else, please uh, drop a comment in the comment section. Uh, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, click the bell for notification, share this with everyone you know, get the word out about the game room, please, and thank you. Uh, if you are part of the original Sorshi family, feel free to come this way. We, we play games, we still do a lot of the silly shit that we've always done, I promise. Uh, stick around for more of the news content for an FGC and other highlights that we'll be trying to cover along with uh, more tabletop stuff. I'm still trying to work out how we're going to make some of the tabletop stuff work because there's been so many different changes with like Yu-Gi-Oh stuff lately that we're trying to figure out what's the best one to use now. So, that's a thing. That and also I gotta see if I can get anybody into the Magic the Gathering one. That one might be a little bit harder because I think that one's pay to play. But I'll, I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. Uh, but if you guys have any suggestions for content, also let us know that in the comment section below too. Uh, that be all for me. You, you got anything, Kurt? Kurt? No? Nothing? How about you, Maze? I guess I guess the that I think our uh, party chat just dropped. But please be sure to check out uh, Crooks the Goat's channel, which is indeed as his name is Crooks the Goat on YouTube. Please and thank you. With that, we'll catch you guys next time.